Hello, I'm back on here. It's um 10.28 p.m. The previous video was supposed to have been my last video for the night, but <clears throat> I can't, I, I feel like I can't rest or go to sleep in, until or unless I talk about what just happened. So I kind of talked about it a little bit in a previous video. So um, this Henry Eberhardt person, um, I didn't really watch his videos, but um, <clears throat> but it's like he questioned. He was the one who questioned me about um. You know, about the whole entire sidewalk at the downtown library is, um, I didn't even think about it or realize until he pointed it out because it wasn't black and white. But now I realize, yeah, it is checkerboard. So, but I did not realize that. <clears throat> and I have no control over that, you know. That's like, um. So, so it's like I guess he when I answer his question, it's like he demanded an answer for oh um the very first part of your video is it, the ground is checkerboard why and so I said I was just coming from the library you know I. And so, well, I already explained some stuff in the previous video, but I was saying that I had just come from the lab, walked out of the library, you know, and so then, um, I think he got hateful and blocked me, and now he's going to smear campaign and lie and say that. I'm part of the occult or Freemasonry or something like that. It's like, you know, even though I'm against Freemasonry and the occult and everything like that, but I don't have any control over the, um, the freaking sidewalk. You know, it seemed like as if he, you know, jumped to conclusion too soon and just made false assumptions and then got hateful and blocked me. But I've heard rumors about people were trying to, like it was two or three years ago, I heard that people make rumors and I don't know if it was lies, false rumors or smear campaigns, but I've heard rumors people about people saying that he was a Freemason. You know, I have no ties to Freemasonry or the fusion centers or nothing like that. So, um, you know, I'm homeless on the streets downtown. And, you know, I have been going to that library, you know, off and on, sometimes every day, sometimes not, depending on my circumstance and my situation. But just because he saw that, I mean, I I don't know. I just feel so bad right now because this it was beyond my control and not even my fault. I mean, I was a child in foster care and had no control over. I think we were in eighth grade and the hallway that was right by my room, the fake foster mom, Adrian Felder had her cousin, Ed, Edward Collins. She had him put tile down and it was a, it really was a black and white Masonic checkerboard pattern floor, but I didn't know any better back then. I knew nothing about the Illuminati Freemasonry or nothing. And then I think um, when the foster mom switched me to Joni's other room, um, I think that was, 
green and ye- a green and yellow Masonic checkerboard. But um, it's like seeing like a lot of bad stuff happen in that hallway, like as if that was the quote unquote bad luck hallway. <clears throat> and so that's also the same hallway that the fake foster sister Shelly, when we were in eighth grade. And she forced us to um, scrub the floors like Aunt Jemima and then bullying, harassing, and laughing at us while we're scrubbing the floor. <clears throat> but um, that's like, in my circumstance, you know, I don't even feel right having this... Um, red and gray sleeping bag. So I'm planning as soon as possible to go get another sleeping bag that's not red. But now I got no choice at this moment because I don't have the funds to go and get... I mean, I barely have enough for food. So I don't even have the funds to go and get me, um, you know another sleeping bag until Monday. So, um, you know, so-called targeted individuals will try to make all kinds of false assumptions and jump to conclusions, excuse me, and even falsely accuse me of perping them in, in the video and stuff like that, you know, and, um, See, noise, harassment. They would even try to, um, they would even, they would even try to, um, you know, falsely accuse me of perping them just by having this in my video. I mean, it's freaking cold and I don't have anything else, but someone gave me this and I'm, got no choice but to use it until until Monday, you know. But I don't even talk to Henry Abraham. He just made a few comments on my um they're doing that on purpose. I can hear the noise harassment above um I mean So, um, I forgot what else I was going to say, but, um, I guess that's another, I guess, strike against, uh, uh, you know, another misunderstanding and a false strike, another false strike against me in the TI community. If he would go make false rumors and lying and saying that I'm connected with the occult and stuff like that. You know, and then I'm not allowed to explain myself or try to clear the false rumors or clear things up. <clears throat> you know, but um, that's the that's the um, you know, the moment I walked out of the library. There, sometimes I start the video and still be inside the library, and this perp he keep on walking over here. Now he's wearing red, black, and white. So, um, you know, as I said, I heard a lot of rumors. I don't know if they were true or false, but See, I'm still getting harassed. It's like, what the hell am I supposed... What the hell should I do? So it's another false strike against me to get more professed targeted individuals to hate my guts. You know, 
And if I showed the same footage, I mean, the same scenery just about every day, almost every day, sometimes, you know, um, So it's another false bad strike against me to make other professed targets have a fake reason to hate me. But, you know, about two or three years ago, I heard a lot of professed target individuals try to say that he was a doggone Freemason. And then he was putting comments on my channel, on my videos, telling me to ignore the perps. And which the popular fakes, they love to talk about ignore and try to lie and say it's all psychological. No, these perps out here keep trying to kill us. <clears throat> so, um, and then Wayne Morris from Australia, I've heard people make rumors saying that he was a Mason and a fake TI perp. So I don't, I don't know, you know, um, it was about a year ago about the video with Monique, you know, with that video. And I saw him being like, oh, yeah, I trust you, Monique. And so um, so I figured that, oh, you're against me now. So even a so-called targeted individual community, people rather choose popularity over truth. I mean, if they see a popular fake T.I. perp that's sold out, they would rather go with that person than somebody who's truly being targeted and still being targeted and seen as a quote-unquote nobody in the T.I. community. <clears throat> but, I mean, Wayne Morris, he did donate me $80 one time you know, to help me stay in the, in that extended stay hotel room longer, you know, but I felt betrayed that he was like, oh yeah, I trust you, Monique, and stuff like that, so, <clears throat> I mean, nobody said she was fucked up or wrong for that video that she did about me, come on, man. See, they're doing this on purpose. I got my earbuds in now. I'm trying to um put on film any of the, any of these freaking cars that want to pass by. <clears throat> so I felt like I had to vent and release my emotions about this because then I would be upset and worried all night and lose another night of sleep. <clears throat> so, um, I'm getting persecuted and abused behind something that I wasn't even really aware of, you know, I didn't even make that connection and come to think of it. Oh, now I realize, but I think he got hateful and blocked me on, um, I, he, he got hateful and blocked me, but that um, gang stalking attention awareness. He had two A's on attention awareness. A few months ago, I was still at the motel and he got hateful and blocked me for on Twitter for who, who, who knows what reason. Now, I don't. I don't even freaking contact or talk to him. <clears throat> so, you know, they got so many damn weirdos in the so-called Ti community. It's freaking frustrating. I guess I better off. I guess I am better off by myself. 